when Arthur Lewis arrived here in 1933, um, LSE was still a, a relatively young institution. It was less than 40 years old, but already a very vibrant one, starting new disciplines and exploring new ideas in things like economics and sociology. Although the student body was quite small, it was already extremely diverse with students coming here from the Far East, from India, from North America and from Africa. We know that uh, Lewis would have overlapped here, for instance, with Yomo Kenyatta, who was studying anthropology, and also another future Nobel Prize winner, Ralph Bunch. Although Lewis's uh, great academic abilities helped him in terms of doing his degree and um, doing research here, we do know that he said that he um, encountered casual, what he called casual racial discrimination of problems with accommodation, problems with jobs, with uh, going into restaurants. And indeed in 1937 when he finished his degree, he failed to get a job as a colonial officer. Uh, because the colonial officer routinely never appointed local people to that role, and that meant no black people. Also, when he got his uh, post here in 1938, although the uh, appointment committee was absolutely unanimous that he should be appointed, the director, Carl Saunders, felt that he needed to check the appointment with the Court of Governors and also set certain restrictions on Lewis's teaching. So, for instance, he only ever taught students in groups. Obviously, Lewis was you know, academically, you know, very brilliant. But I think one of the things that really marked him out was that he was very diligent and very hardworking. Um, during the time when he was teaching at LSE at Cambridge, he was spending the terms with a very heavy teaching load and then the vacations doing research for the colonial office. But I think he also had a great deal of self-confidence and perhaps even courage. Um, he was able to um, stand up to his own views on economics against the views of some very high-flying members of the economics department like Lionel Robbins and Friedrich Hayek. Uh, when he was working for the colonial office, he wasn't afraid to make his own views quite clear that economics was more than being just about numbers and money. Uh, it was about the whole condition of life. Lewis was very lucky in being at um, LSE in the 1930s. His teachers would have included Lionel Robbins, uh, Friedrich Hayek and John Hicks. But in fact, probably the person who influenced him the most was Professor Arnold Plant, who's much less well known. Um, he was Professor of Commerce and he and Lewis got on extremely well. Uh, Lewis had wanted to be an engineer at one stage and in fact Plant had actually been a mechanical engineer before he came into academia. Um, he'd also taught in South Africa and had become vehemently opposed to the racial laws there as being very, um, having a very negative effect on the employment market in South Africa. So there was obviously some commonality of interest and commitment there. The Second World War brought Lewis opportunities that he might not possibly have had if in normal circumstances. Um, he was left as one of the few members of academic staff who were not called up for either military or civil service and he moved with the school to Cambridge during its uh, evacuation and took on a great deal of the economics teaching load. He was teaching transport economics, he was teaching business economics, elements of economics. Uh, and towards the end of the time there was a move towards also doing what became known as colonial economics. It also opened up opportunities for him in doing research. When the uh, school was approached by the colonial office for somebody to do economic research into colonial, uh, what we would now call colonial development and colonial economics, um, they said that Lewis was the best man for the job and although Lewis appears that he didn't always enjoy his time at the colonial office, it was an opportunity to do some work he might not have had if other economics had, economists had still been around. <laughs>